hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and here is my messy jewelry table that I work at um, I am here with a Christmas collab that I am participating in um, it started in January and um, this is actually supposed to have gone up on the 28th of February um, I had so much going on last month that I somehow completely missed seeing this on the calendar and where it's a newer collab I it just slipped my mind so I apologize to Bobby Joe and Michelle who are the hosts of this um, collab I apologize to you two and to all the other participants um, for getting this up a week late um, I was just looking at my calendar this evening, <clears throat> making sure and you know, seeing what collabs were coming up and what I need to be work on, working on. And I just happened to all of a sudden, I don't know how I happened to think of it. And I went back on my channel and realized that I never did a video for this. <clears throat> this is um, a, like I said, this is a Christmas 365 collab. And it is just um, for myself and other people who really enjoy making Christmas themed projects. Um, this can be anything Christmas and it does go up the last day of each month. Now um, for this month um, I did well for February I should say um, I went I made some Christmas stitch markers for my crochet. I am planning on I um, have several projects in mind that I would like to be crocheting for people for this coming Christmas. And I thought, well, if I had a Christmassy stitch marker um, to hang on off of it, if like in between when I'm working on it, <clears throat> then I would remember easily that this is a Christmas project that I'm working on. Um, these are just some cute little charms that I found in my Christmas beading box. One of mine, I have like multiple <laughs> containers of Christmas um, jewelry items. This adorable Santa Claus. And then these um, little beads here. I did take a, um, I have a container of different colored glass beads from BB Crafts, and I just used a different colored one on each of these. This is black, and I used it on the Santa, and I just used an eye pin for the little bead, and then just hung the charm from the bottom of there, and then put a larger sized lobster claw on there. Um, this is an angel charm, and I used sort of a dark purple bead for that. Um, this really pretty ornate wreath charm and I went with a green bead um, this adorable little snowman and I went with blue on that one here's a candy cane charm that I used a red bead and then I love this one this is of course my favorite I don't even remember having these <laughs> these little charms um, I have quite a few of these I, I probably had 10 or, or 12 in the box and he is adorable that little Santa hat and the little tiny little ball or a bead hanging off of the end of the hat and he's got his little whiskers on his face and a smiley mouth and so I went with a sort of a frosted gray or maybe a black sort of a frosty black um, bead for that one so that is my project share and again um, this is going up late uh, normally it would have been on the last day of February so here is my project these really quick and easy crochet stitch markers thank you so much everyone for watching i will have the links uh, to all the channels down in my description below in case you have not seen those you can go and catch up on them and thank you so much everyone for watching i'll talk to y'all next time take care